Welcome to the Paramount Theater in Oakland, California. I'm your host, Sierra Mora, and tonight we're here at the second annual Laugh Fest with comedians such as Marlon Wayne, This nigga need rehab. JB Smooth. Ah, 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 the only motherfucker wearing red on a motherfucking Valentine's Day goddamn show. And Chris Spencer. Little civil rights bus, come on in and lay arms late. As well as other talented comedians. Hosted by Arsenio Hall. What the fuck? Okay. I think your ID and the microphone. We're here in the lobby. We're about to talk to some of the audience. So please stick around. You do not want to miss it. Okay, where are you guys from? Michigan, Detroit area. Michigan. Oh, How did you hear about tonight's event? My wife told me about it. And there's a show coming up. And she bought a ticket and we're here. Our girls are nurses, and late <laughs> night they plan this gig, and we're pumped. <laughs> and what brings you guys out tonight? Uh, Marley Wayans. Marley Wayans? Yeah. Valentine's Day, so I just got a surprise. <laughs> what kind of show are we going to expect? Man, you get your popcorn ready, dog. That's the deep y'all. So how did you like the audience tonight? Man, Oakland showed a lot of love. When I was out there, I was like, I could see why Jamie Foxx taped a special here. I think it's called I Might Need Security. And they were just really fun. Like, I want to come back so, again. So, um, do you have any comedians that you look up to or that you did look up to before you became one yourself? I look up to J.B. Smooth. I like J.B. Smooth. I love this goddamn song right here. Shit. You can't do this shit with loose pants on. You got to do this with tight-ass pants like mine. As well as a comedian. Yes. Which one do you enjoy doing more, acting or oh, comedy? Uh, I like both. You know, the, 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 the cool thing about doing stand up is you get that immediate reaction from the audience. I can, I can do this show tonight, have a great time, go to my hotel room, laugh at some of the stuff we talked about, hang on my colleagues, man, Arsenio uh, and, and Chris Spencer and, 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 and Marlon Wayans, and we can all have a good time. And it's like, we, it's like our reunion of some sense. What's up, Oakland? Who's 20 in their 20s, 20s? Okay, my, my jokes aren't for you, okay? So why don't, why don't you pull out your phone and go look for Pokemon when I talk to these adults? 30, 30, 30. I'm your host, Sierra Moore, and we're here backstage with Chris Spencer. How are you doing today? I'm fantastic. How are you? I'm great. Thank yeah, you for sure, asking. Sure. So Wasn't how I great? Wasn't I great? Didn't I rip that shit? Yes, he just okay, got great. off the stage. I need you to say that when you bring me up next time. <laughs> and then we also have JB Smooth here. You both were I've heard of him. Real Husbands of Hollywood. Yeah, he's a, he's I've known JB 25 years plus. <laughs> And he's always been a delight. Arsenio, I've done his show. I've, I've always been a big fan. Marlon and I did the Six Man together. Ryan and I are going to start doing some projects together. So this is a great, great lineup. It's a great weekend. Put your hands together for the comedy of Ryan Davis. Come on, brother. Let me touch you. Bam. What's up, Oakland? Yeah, man, shit, happy to be here. I'm, I was feeling myself a little bit, though, when they put me on this show. I was like, shit, I'm famous now. Until I got here and a nigga tried to sell me tickets outside. <laughs> so we're here backstage with Arsenio Hall and Ryan Davis. How are you guys this evening? Great. Yeah, Great. yeah we good, right, dog? Yeah, I'm doing all we, right. Yeah, we gonna try to pretend like we don't see this dress. <laughs> You see, you see how I'm staring at the camera? Then. Yeah, people get in trouble now. People get yeah. in trouble for crazy I saw, shit. I saw the Me Too hashtag. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody gonna be like, I remember that time I was with Ryan. No, you don't. Mm -mm. Ryan was... Mm -mm. Yeah. That, You're a vet in the game, been around a long time. How do you think the comedy industry has changed from when you first started till now? You know what? This is a perfect time to talk about that. Because back in the day, what you do is you get on TV. That was the big thing, get on TV. And then your stuff lives forever on YouTube, but it's flipped. And the brother to your right is one of the gentlemen helping to flip it. We discovered him on YouTube. And now, because he's so popular on YouTube, he's coming to TV and film. So, 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 so young brothers like that man right there are changing the game. You hit him in the gut the right way and you just look at him, hey, stop that. You gotta, sometimes you see us, you gotta disrespect it, fellas. You gotta go a little deep. Marlon Wayans, how are you doing tonight? Good, good. Tired. Tired. <laughs> Do you come to Oakland often? Uh, 
Yeah, I like the, the Bay. I always perform out here. We know you and your family started off with doing Live in Color, and you know you've blown up since then. What was that experience like working back then? Um, it was for us. For me, it was uh, college. I love the connection with the live audience doing stand up. A lot of people don't even know I do stand up, but uh, my first stand up special, Wokish, is coming out February 27th on Netflix. So make sure y'all check that out. Well, we know you have a lot going on tonight. I don't want to keep you too long, but I do want to thank you so much You're for welcome. talking to us. You're and welcome. you have a wonderful evening. You too. God bless. Thank you. God bless.